My name is Christian Corey and I'm an experimental test pilot at Sikorsky Aircraft. In the uh, Raider program, I'm, uh, I'm sort of one of the guys that has the opportunity to fly the aircraft, but also participates in some of the uh, developmental meetings and the design. How do we get to the next step? So it's a bit of what we do. You can do things where you, you'd want to target something, for example, and you can, you can sort of hang there better than on a traditional helicopter. It gives you more flexibility in how to operate. Straight up, like speed is going to be the advantage. It's 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 a lot faster than you can go in a traditional helicopter. Um, on X2, you're able to to go faster without rotating the fuselage. So it's a level attitude that you maintain throughout. You know your your speed sweep, if you will. I think the biggest difference between a, a fundamental, like traditional helicopter and the X2 is that prop that's on the back, right? It's taken really like the best part of like a vertical a stovall, like a Harrier or the new Joint Strike Fighter that can, you know, it's this jet that can, can take off or land vertically and then go forward. Uh, X2 and the Raider can, can do that indefinitely, the same as a helicopter, until it's time to go fast and then it operates better in that regime as well. Forget everything you know about helicopters. X2 technology combines the best elements of low speed helicopter performance with the cruise performance of an airplane. It's going to change the game.